The chupacabra isn't the only mysterious creature that might be wandering around in the woods. Hey. Just ask 14-year-old Keelan Majuri of Ontario, Canada. He heard about a strange creature that may be two regular creatures fused into one. Up. <laughs> Take a look on the Mystery Illustrator. Dear Doubting Dave, I've heard of a creature that's part jackrabbit and part antelope called the jackalope. It's supposed to be just a myth, like unicorns and dragons. But I read on the internet that people have actually seen them. Is the jackalope real? Well, Keelan, people have been trying to prove that jackalopes exist for centuries. Ah, it's only Bigfoot. Jackalope sightings go back to the 1500s, but most scientists believed they were either mistakes or hoaxes. Then, about 50 years ago, something incredible happened. Someone got a picture of a jackalope, and it wasn't blurry like most monster photos. It was crystal clear. But is the creature in that photo really half rabbit, half antelope? <laughs> no. <laughs> this animal is all rabbit, but he has something called a shope virus. That's what made those growths on his head that look like antlers. And every so-called jackalope photo since then has turned out to be rabbits with the shope virus too. So, Keelan, it looks like somebody probably just saw one of those rabbits and started the legend of the jackalope. Maybe the chupacabra is just a regular animal too. That's how most monster legends get started. All right, so long, buddy. All right. I mean, word is Bigfoot's just a bunch of alley cats who got stuck together fighting over a jar of peanut butter. Thanks for the great email.